Vlogmas day three, you guys. You want to be in it? Can you see a happy golden tail? But Max is about to be home, you guys. He hasn't been home in a bit, so we're gonna surprise him. Lucy and I got us all matching PJs at Target the other day. Lucy's, Max's, mine, they're all the same. And we, I'm sure you can tell by the title, are going to decorate for Christmas in this vlog. It's going to be so exciting. I can't wait to get this place. Looking all festive, huh? gonna love. I'm gonna leave them like right here because they'll definitely come in the garage. Leave them like that. Okay, can't wait for his reaction. Just heard the garage. What is happening? Vlogmas. Yeah, it is vlogmas. Hi, Brody. I love. Isn't that fun? <laughs> hey everybody, I'm back. You like him? Long time now see. <laughs> you so happy to see him. Are you so happy? Okay everyone, it's time. It's time. Max. So there might have only been an XL men's and not a large. I should have got you. You are swimming in that. <laughs> Like it. He's grounding himself. Oh. Nah. Brody, <laughs> did you show him? Yeah, good <laughs> Give us a twirl. Okay. Okay. Will you give us a twirl, St. <laughs> Nick? Wait, put down the thing and we can all do that. <laughs> Should I show them the waist? <laughs> Guys, they're a little big. <laughs> Room to grow and know. Oh my god. When you have all your, your Christmas treats. Yeah, throw my cookies and milk. <laughs> Wait, now I'm realizing we actually have more Christmas pillows in the closet. So I gotta go through those too. There's one that has like a snowflake, one with like Christmas trees, but wait, now that I'm looking at this through the camera, I don't know if I like it. Maybe that blanket there is throwing me off. Cause I just saw these at Target the other day with Lucy and I snatched them up, the red and the green. And this green one I like more than I thought, but these like plaid ones, I don't know. I really don't know if they go the vibe. But like maybe with the other ones it'll look better. I guess we shall see cleared space for where our Christmas tree is gonna go and we added this little fuzzy one that I found at Target 2 right here I don't know if I like it here it might end up moving but I just thought it was so cute and like goes with the vibe of the apartment but still like a Christmas tree you know so love that I don't know if we'll keep it there though I guess we'll see it's the next morning welcome to my bathroom as you can tell we only got like a teeny tiny bit into decorating for Christmas we will finish that momentarily because we were so tired last night we did didn't even get out our Christmas tree and all our ornaments and everything. We're like, okay, we'll just do it tomorrow. Um, but basically what we've been doing since this morning is just sort of like picking up, vacuuming, everything like that. I feel like getting all the decorations out, putting some things away. We just want it all to be like clean and everything good, you know, before we're like moving stuff around. So we actually just threw our sheets in the wash, our duvet cover. We like definitely needed a wash and I don't know, it's just gonna feel really good today to have everything clean and in order, all our decorations set up, especially there's like no better feeling than having our bed all clean and cozy, especially with our Brooklyn and Chief. I like can't wait to go to sleep tonight in them, which is reminding me, I was telling you guys because I actually just got this bath rug in from Brooklyn and this is the tufted bath rug and I'm happy this is a great time to remind you guys or I want to remind myself to tell you guys because basically everything in my apartment is Brooklyn. I'm such a Brooklyn stan and they actually are having a 15% off holiday month long sale. So I'll have Brooklyn in link down below. I'm obsessed with them. Oh, this is so good. I needed this for our guest bath because our other towels were just like 
crappity, cra crappity, crappy quality and dingy and we needed like some nice ones. Brooklyn and knows how like really high quality bedding, sheets, towels can get so expensive, which is why they have very like luxurious quality and comfort pieces like bedding, towels, bath mats, but without the luxury price tag. So this is just gonna be like so soft and nice. I'll show you ours is like literally right there. So I'm gonna go set this up in our guest bath. Also, like everything you see around me is Brooklyn. Super plush towels. We have the hand towels. Right here is my bathrobe. They're amazing. Basically, I bought their Lux Sateen sheets duvet cover before we even moved in to like get delivered here because I knew I wanted them. I knew it was such nice bedding. And then I also bought their super plush towels because I heard such nice things. They're just like super plush, exactly how it says. It's so soft and nice. It feels like hotel, like spa towel. So when Brooklyn and reached out and was like, hey, wanna work together? I was like, um, yes, my entire print literally I bought myself is Brooklyn in. So yeah, definitely take advantage of the 15% off holiday sale. Again, link down below. You guys, they have over 80,000 five-star reviews. Like the quality. Let me show you the quality. It's just unreal. Here's the Brooklyn and robe. I was telling you it was right here. I got this gray color. Oh, it's so nice. After trying their sheets, duvet cover, pillowcases, everything, it made so much sense to me why I was like, hey, I absolutely need these towels because the quality is just unreal. Like I said, very like lush, spa-like experience. Also, not only do they just like feel great and are so absorbent, I get insane reviews from my guests. Lucy, when I just had Louisa and Paul, my friends here, they were like, what the heck are these towels? We need them. They're so cozy. They feel like I'm wrapped up in like a nice big blanket. This is the super plush towel but they also have bath sheets which we got as well because they're like huge like blankets almost and I believe I got the move-in bundle which I wanted to shout out to you guys because it has bath towels as hand towels it has washcloths it has the bath mat and so the move-in bundle is just so good especially if you are moving in somewhere new also over here here is a hand towel they oh you guys you can really see in this one it's like a blanket they're just so nice the super plush is definitely as you can tell because I bought them all already is my preference because it's just like very luxurious feeling they have so many colors to choose from there's different patterns and i know it's 100 percent turkish cotton which is why they're so nice i can talk about these dang towels all day long they're just the most comfortable towels i've ever used like in my whole life i could not recommend them enough and i'll make sure when we put on our sheets and duvet cover later that i show you guys so you can see like the feel of the luxe sateen that's personally my my favorite I know they have like linen percal other ones too but it just feels like so soft and smooth and luxurious so yeah I thought this would be a great time to remind you guys of all my favorite Brooklinen pieces bath mat towels sheets bedding all the things they really have amazing gifts for everybody keep your family cozy and comfy feeling good this holiday season yeah just want to remind you guys since the sale is going on again at Brooklyn it will be linked down below 15% off all their products and now let's continue with the decorating for Christmas we are running errands we're going to the post office and we're going to FedEx to get another package oh and we're going to the rink tell oh, me yeah. why we're going to the ring. We're going right back up. They just, I just don't even keep them updated at this point. Oh, the last vlog was when you got called the boss time. And then he just got sent down for less than a day. And now, and now he's going back. So it's always see ya when I see ya. Yeah. Which will be um Sunday. Sunday. Or if, maybe earlier. If, you if I go to visit. And we're on it's very them. hard to make plans, people. You can't really make plans at all. No. <laughs> I wanted to tell you guys, we just got to the post office, but sending the most exciting package, so I wanted to fill you in. Our friends are getting... A golden. <laughs> <laughs> like a golden puppy. It's, he's gonna be a Christmas pup. Yeah. In December, so they're getting him so soon. And so I'm just sending like some things that were Brody's favorites, like a snuggle puppy. If you guys are getting a puppy, snuggle puppy is a lifesaver. And like a blanket and some toys and stuff. And so that's what we're sending right now. And then, I'm not even gonna tell you, the package we're picking up is like crazy. Mm -hmm. And it's crazy That's that good. I can't keep it for another day. Store it for another day. You didn't yeah, get it here. It's gonna be off. I know, but it's about to close, so I'm gonna run in. Here we go. Here goes nothing. Oh, might it be a little squished? Ah, <laughs> the vacuum ready. <laughs> Hey 
What do you think? I love it. Is it really hot? Uh, no, not too bad. My eyes still burn mm. from cutting the, the onion. onion. Who cut mm. the onion? Me. Is that a phrase? Mm -hmm. Oh, when you're crying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like, not familiar. Mm -mm -mm. I don't know, I wanna try it with. Or I wanna hear what you think first. That was a lot. No. We just did normal red sauce. We did Rao's tomato basil, which I normally do with it. And I just wanted to do that since that's what I always do when I make bolognese. So I didn't want to stray. But we wanted to maybe do truff because we like love truff. So Max added some. Mm. Good. Mm -hmm. Like I'll like it. Yeah. How could you not? Mmm. Okay. If you want my recipe. I literally make it off of one time a girl. Oh yeah. I forgot. <clears throat> was talking about it on her stories. And she was like, I literally just do like onion, bell pepper, any old veggies that are in your fridge with like olive oil, garlic, like minced garlic. And then you add the beef and then you add paprika, cumin, and salt, pepper, whatever. Mm. Mix it all up. And then pasta sauce, add the boiled, like cooked pasta in. So good. So, so good. So it's so simple. It's so quick and easy. I was saying it's the coziest meal. Mm-hmm. really mm. We're having the coziest meal. Warms the body. With our decorating. Mm -hmm. And I'm matching jammies. <laughs> I was filming. I started right before you came in. I was like, let's see his reaction. Mm. I didn't know if you had much of a reaction. You were just like, oh, hi. Right. No. I was happy to see him. <laughs> Good thing they shrunk a little in the wash because you, mm. <laughs> you were swimming. Yeah, in I was. They were falling off. <laughs> now they're good. I'm so happy we're doing this. Before you leave. Mm -hmm. mm. I get on the road again. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I cannot wait to hop in this bed. This is what I was promising you guys. Look at how like soft and smooth. Oh, these are seriously the best sheets in the whole wide world. Again, we get the Lux Satin, I think I say it, or Lux Satin, Satin. And they're just so freaking nice. You're about to hop up again. It's your favorite thing when we make the bed, huh? To get in the way. Oh yeah, you got your candy cane. <laughs> Come on, Come on. Come on. Favorite cheese, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Get cozy. <laughs> so, where's Max going? Okay, you guys, it's way later now. It's literally so late, but I wanted to walk you through everything because I wanted this to mainly be a decorating for Christmas vlog. Sorry if this is on the shorter end, by the way. But yeah, I just wanted it to be specific to this because I think it's so important and so cute and really just put us in the holiday mood. And it was really fun. Okay, let's start with the tree. This is from Target like three years ago now. I got it in Boston. This is like not focusing very well. I don't know why. Okay, there we go. I think it's better now. But yes, I got it in Boston at Target with Taylor when I lived there the year after I graduated. This is really struggling. It might be because of the lights. I don't know. Okay, we'll get close. Then all these ornaments, I really don't know where these ones came from. We really don't have too many, but these, oh, 
that one has to be from Target last year, like Home Goods or something. These are probably from again, like Target or Home Goods. Same Target or Home Goods. I don't even remember. It must be Target. I feel like I remember being at Target. This plaid blanket we have, we've always used as like a tree skirt down there. And oh my goodness, I just stepped on you. Someone came to join me. You were suddenly underfoot. Okay, again, we're really struggling with the focus, but that's that. This must also be from Target last year, I'm guessing. We didn't have as much stuff up here, so this I feel like looked better last year because now we have like the Sono sound bar. I got this little furry tree. I know I showed you guys yesterday from Target. I put some lights with it, and I don't know. I just think it's really festive and cute. Max found this like Christmas tree smelling candle from last year. He whipped it out, and then our little stockings i believe are also from target like everything's just target christmas section from last year we got the b for brody and then these fuzzy ones are max's and mine i don't know if i've said it yet but brody max and i will probably be celebrating christmas early again this year like we did last year just because i will go home to albany where i'm from to be with my family he'll probably go to the cape where he's from to be with his family on actual christmas i think he only gets like three days off this year with hockey so yeah, we'll probably just do I think last year we did Christmas on the 21st the two of us So we'll probably do that again. Are you loving the Christmas tree, dude? Yeah <laughs> Okay, then we've got oh no, I'm remembering. Okay, this can be in tomorrow's vlog then I gotta remember I think they're in this closet in the office If you guys remember if you've been watching my vlogs, I think I've had these for like two years I have one they're like really cute like neutral pillows at the bed target like two years ago And one ha it's like beige and it has like white Christmas trees on it and the other one's like like maybe white beige with a white snowflake. So I need to put these out here too. But for now, we just have these ones that I got at Target the other day. This one is like really bothering me now. I don't know why these are okay to me because like this green one is really grown on me. I just think it looks like nice. And then this is kind of green to like go with. But the red is like throwing me off. I guess it's fine and Christmassy and whatever. And I guess the poinsettia kind of pulls it all together. Huh, buddy. <laughs> but this is actually fake. Probably from Target or Home Goods again. And I think I got it in the last year or so because i was posting instagram stories and everyone's like oh my gosh no poinsettias are toxic to dogs and i'm like oh no this is literally plastic so yeah don't worry about that you guys saw brody broke out his little <laughs> decaying toy not little it's actually massive and he brought it with him in his little house which is also not a little house. It's very big. <laughs> he just loves his crate. And so he brought his toy in there. And the last place that is a little Christmassy and cute. If you guys saw, I think in the montage I showed, we switched out the sort of fall themed, like, I don't even know what you call it, bowl filler that I got at Target. We just put in these pine cones that I got last year. They smell so good. And I love the ones that are like snowy looking. So that's cute. We threw another strand of white Christmas lights up here. I think I just threw this little tree. We have another one of these that I threw in the office but it's like messy in there so I'm not gonna show you guys but it's literally the same yeah so that is really cute really turning into vlogmas the next day and I'm realizing we have a wreath right here I can show you <laughs> through the door but I'm kind of scared to open the door and go out there because now I'm alone in today I'm like freaking myself out being by the windows right here <laughs> can I not does anyone else when they're alone be like ah, I'm like I need to take melatonin and go to bed because I'm gonna freak out over here uh yeah I get a little paranoid and I'm alone are you chewing on the tree skirt I remember you doing that last year Max was like do you remember Brody like loved chewing on that blanket he's gonna have a field day oh wait one more thing there's like a lot going on I have bags I didn't put away I have like workout clothes for tomorrow but this my mom got for me last year it says sleigh bells ring and she goes I saw this and I thought of you because it kind of like goes with like the white and beige of your apartment so I think it's so cute and I like to just throw it on our dresser it makes it a little Christmassy in a bedroom are you chewing on that tree skirt over there Brody Brody I'm literally catching you in the act and you do not care I think it's the little like frayed edges like the fringe naughty naughty okay i'm going to end off this vlog here i hope you guys enjoy just like a little something a little decorations i said to max i can't wait for our freaking breakers to turn off the to trip or whatever it's called basically all our lights go off whenever we had our christmas lights plugged in last year so i'm sure that's gonna happen soon that's gonna be annoying to deal with because like all the christmas lights plugged in our electricity just like freaks out and i guess we don't have like that strong of electricity are you trying to get your candy cane out? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Wait, I'm realizing 
yeah, this is gonna be a fail this year already. P.S. I just ended it off, but I was like, wait, I didn't do a question of the day. Well, that's typical me of fashion. I always forget. And this year, you guys might remember from literally Vlogmas Day 1 that I'm gonna do at the end of the vlog. But for Vlogmas Day 2 and tomorrow 4, I'm doing gift guides. So, like, they're not gonna be in there, but, like, in the real vlogs, I'll do it. So, for this one, question of the day, if you made it to this very last moment, you can comment down below. Tell me what is, like, the number one thing you're asking for this year i want to know it can be like a material gift that you want it can be world peace you know something it can be like an experience just something let me know something that you want or maybe something that you're grateful for that could be cute too either or maybe both comment down below i want to know maybe the number one thing i want for christmas this year honestly is not anything like a gift in specific it would just be to like have really great quality time with my friends and family that i spend the holidays with and make some nice memories and what i'm most grateful for is probably my little family here and the home that we built. I got so many replies tonight that he sounds like he's tearing apart his toy. I got so many replies that it's like so cozy and homey here and yeah, it just made me really grateful for that because it's really sweet and so I'm feeling grateful for that. Anyway, finally ending this off here. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.